Representative Davidson to introduce legislation to fire Gary Gensler for crypto overreach. This is absolutely fantastic. So basically, um, Davidson wants to introduce legislation that would remove Gensler as chair of the SEC and replace him with the director. This was in response to Coinbase's legal chief, Paul Grawl. Apologies for butchering that. Who is commenting on Hester Peirce's statement about the latest announcement from the SEC about revisiting the proposed redefinition of an exchange? You know that whole DeFi thing that happened over the weekend. I, I believe that's what happened, right, guys? Anyways, Gensler said the proposed rule amendments could benefit investors and markets by bringing certain brokers under more regulatory scrutiny, as well as modernizing rules and that define exchanges. I gotta get Jen's feedback on this because why not? Okay, I just got a caveat. As the hash legal expert, it's just the blind leading the blind. I don't know the ins and outs of the legal system, but I try. So I read this tweet by Rep. Davidson. Uh, he said, to correct a long series of abuses, I'm introducing legislation that removes the chairman of the, Sec of the Securities and Exchange Commission and replaces the role with an executive director. Now, there are many steps when it comes to passing a law, many, many steps for this to you know, fall off, Wendy. So I don't know if we're going to see Gary Gensler removed anytime soon, but I do love a good shakeup. So I think the statement itself probably served the purpose. I think it's going to get a lot of people talking about what the SEC is doing when it comes to crypto companies. I think that's what the statement was meant to do. I don't know if we're going to see this law get put into place and Gary Gensler get kicked out the front door. Zach? Big old meh for me. This is just like when <laughs> AOC and Liz Warren were like, Silicon Valley Bank, you suck. Why are you so bad? This is just the same thing. This is just politics, man. Politicians grandstanding about stuff. I don't care about the content of it. It's just, it is what it is. It's meh. It's big old meh. It's not going to happen. Don't make I will, Wendy mad. I will say, I will it. say before I toss it to Will, and then we also we have something else we have to discuss in the, within the story. But before I toss it to Will, I believe that they formed a brand new. Oh, I sh forgot what it is, but they're going to be grilling Gary tomorrow. I think it's a House committee. There's it was a brand new organization that within the government that was created. Um, I want to say January first of 2023, but basically they're going to be grilling Gary. I think it is tomorrow. So, um, Will, your thoughts on this? I'm here for a good uh, grilling session, regardless of who it is. No, I'm a Zach. This is a thoroughly mid story. We do do not really need to focus on it too much, in my opinion, because you don't this like is a what good politicians do. It's not going to happen, Jen. I'm sorry. Like, I know gonna it's not going to gonna happen. It. I said that. Hey, <laughs> it's fun. Be we're it's, talking. It's, 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 it's extreme. <laughs> we're, we're, we're talking about a tweet that's basically a story, and that's okay because Warren Davidson's like he's in the mix of this, right? Like he's, I think, on the Blockchain Council caucus within DC. This is sort of his shtick, right? He's always tweeting about the the evils of CBDCs. This is his thing, and I think like maybe the bigger story, if we do want to like find something here is the Republican versus Democratic angle here, right? So like we have a Democratic administration, they're pushing the CBDs front, they're pu pushing on the, uh, the regulatory front. And then we have the other side where there's some Republicans that are more against that. It's not cleanly split yet, but we are starting to see that fragmentation occur. And maybe here's some supporting evidence for that. But that's all I got for this story. I'm totally a Zach on it. Wendy, to you. <laughs> I think that we need to play the soundbite from Coindesk TV's first mover this morning with Hester Purse because she is mother. And what she says goes, gosh golly. It's difficult to know what the implications are going to be because there's, there's a lot of ambiguity. And at the meeting where we voted on this rule, I tried to ask some questions around what this would look like in practice. But a lot of these things are going to be facts and circumstances. Well, what does that mean? That means that at the end of the day, it's going to be the enforcement division that will end up making those calls. See, not a nothing burger. This is important, and we are going to make our voices heard. <laughs> Wait, that's all we said, though. We said that the tweet was probably a nothing burger because, like, the chances of this occurring are pretty slim, right? Like dissolving the <laughs> head know. of the SEC and then replacing it with a board. Like when's the last time you've seen any sort of administration? Like, hey, Gary, like that? Gary Gensler is a, a threat to national security, man. Come on. So is the SEC. Like, come on. Do Maybe it. Ethereum security, but I don't know about national security. I don't know. It's going to be, I mean, if nothing else, it heightens the stakes. You know, Wendy, you mentioned it, right? Gary Gensler is testifying in front of the House Financial Services Committee tomorrow at 10 a.m. Tune in, check it out. 
heightens the stakes a little bit now that we have Rep. David uh, Rep. Davidson sort of um, calling for the head of Gary Gensler here, uh, at least at least on Twitter. So yeah, that check that out. That's gonna be a big one tomorrow. I think a lot of people in the regulatory sphere are gearing up for that one to ask these questions of Gary Gensler uh, and what he's doing at the helm of the SEC. So yeah, I don't know. We're gonna have a viewing party. What do you think? When do you organize anything? It's pretty, pretty early stream. out there. Pretty early out there in we LA. Should, we should all get together and eat Doritos and um, have lime water and watch this. Taco Tuesday. It's Taco oh, Tuesday. Yes, Taco, Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. It's Taco Tuesday. Tuesday.